Hello everyone, and welcome back to Nightingale Plays Factorio, buses, planes, trains, and automobiles. So I went, got some steel, some other stuff, uh, got some wood there, uh, and I'm building a whole ton of pump jacks. I checked out how things look over here. The biters are getting big and aggressive. So uh, this little pollution center that we've created there, yeah, it's it's having an effect on the local population. So we're, we're going to get pretty intense pretty soon here. So let's see, what can we do? We can build a locomotive, but that would mean canceling all of these. So this, oh yeah, we can do lots of pump jacks now. I don't know how many I need, but I'll just build a few. And you can also be a wood train. Oh, you got all the coal. Oh, plastic's finished. That's important. We're a couple steps away. So we got this, and then we are going for electric engine. So that'll get banged up pretty quickly. Yes, it will. Um, you guys, are you... You're producing engines. You need iron. So you're max iron. Those are looking fine. I can't pick a recipe till I do something else. So, okay. Um, we can't build the pumps, so let's go and build more pump jacks, or plop more pump jacks. A little bit harder to do this in the dark, but not impossible. some straight pipe here. Straight pipe has all been used up by probably our construction. All right, uh, electric engine, get this done as quick as possible. And cancel, cancel, cancel. And that one's going, that one's going. This one needs to be hooked up. Go. Ha, knew there was one hiding in there. All right, pump jacks can now go, whoops, here. All right, we have, um, what do we have? No, we're still doing this. Oh, that's right, that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to build a few more pump jacks. Just hooking stuff up. Everybody gets a big electric pole, makes a big ugly mess. All right, keep looking for deep oil. Oil, oil, oil. So let's look on the map. So it's all just in a big ring. So to the right, there should be a nice clunk. I thought I saw three in a row. Is that one? There's one. Yeah, one, two, where's number three? Buff, three. All right, so we've got all our electric engine. So let's finish hooking these guys up. Start a little bit more sparing up. 
it's so close together, all these oil things, that we can actually pretty easily do this. This can go up here. Like that. There you go. It's probably getting so much fuel. All right, make that go away. Electric engines, about time. So you are missing circuits. And that's all my circuits. So, have fun, guys. Okay, so here's five together. Oh, no, six, and they just keep coming. Okay, so nothing to the east. This is... If we get this group, I'm not going to be missing anything. Something like that. Let's power these up first. Okay. Pipes. Uh, it's not going to work particularly well. Let's just go do this over here. We got the pipes here again. Everybody seems to be going in. Okay, it's getting pretty dark here. This is the perimeter. I can't use all of mine. There, I have four. Which means we should probably build a few more of those. Alright, should have a few engines now. Five. Oh, so all they're going to keep stacked up is five unless I pull them out. How many pumps can I build? Twenty. No, well, twenty at a time seems fine. So many are we going to need here? Uh, at least four. Although I may, may want to just do... Well, let's think here. We're going to get uh, one, two, three, four. So how much can these store? 1.7. So these are the same as these, it looks like. So one to one. So if we do if we do four of these for a tanker of four, that should be okay. So these need to be hooked up here. Let's just go for maximum Maximum filling. Okay, so it's that square there that we need to hit into. Yep, that looks mostly good. Last one. More steel pipe. Okay, 
Okay, let's go together. Uh, what's the best way to get these guys all joined into the same thing? I don't think I want to go across because I think that might actually end up being uneven. I'm not 100% sure. But let's go like this. all up and that okay so we need our uh, store chinks okay now we need something to come into the storage tanks engines. Uh, I need at least enough to output at the other end. Uh, coffee there. All right, uh, these are filling up. Are these filling up? Yes, they are. Not uh, particularly fast, though. Hmm. Well, pump checks are definitely producing. These ones are not producing. Which means... Oh, wow. Have we just overloaded the pipe? Is that... You can do that? I haven't played around with this, I'm not so sure now. Yeah, like these guys aren't able to produce at all. Hmm. Well, that's, uh, bit of trouble. If I put a pump somewhere along the line, is that going to help things at all? Anything, it seems to be slowing things down. Well, they're filling up. Not all these are moving. So this is empty. Well, so we can... Uh, Hmm, okay. Well, this is this is different than what I expected to have happen. So I'm just trying to figure out how to best deal with this. So I think we need to break up these storage tanks. Each one of these is going to get their own storage tank. So you guys aren't doing anything right now. So let's take you away. I'm going to put a storage tank right here. What we'll do is we'll put it we'll put it right there. Oh. Oh. 
There goes all our stored oil. Bye bye. Okay, so four storage tanks for those. Then we're going to get another four storage tanks, which are going to act as a sort of balancer. So we're going to put these all together. Except uh, we need to flip things a bit. There we go. So you guys will have inputs. Those. So let's space things out a bit. We'll keep you. And we'll just do a couple double tanks. You guys will be connected like that. And then you. Ah, I want to be able to walk around, so having it so close is a little bit obnoxious. So just to make sure I don't make the same mistake again. Would that be better? Yeah, I think that would be better. So we can just go like that. That's a much easier connection. I'm being quite wasteful with the underground pipe doing this, but it's it's just so annoying not being able to rock around stuff. And if I go like that, then it's easy. All right, there we go. Everything, oh, nope, these sets need to hook up together. So everything can go, so this will cause everything to be balanced. And you can see right now the well, it shouldn't be coming out of here. It should be balancing between these. Okay, and then we're just going to do four pipes. So how many do we have here? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Jeez, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. So 26 divided by 4, that is uh, 24 is 6. So 6 in a bit. So 6 or 7 each. And so, yeah, so as long as these are underground pipes, they're not going to mix. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six. You guys are one big group. So you guys are now all connected. You can be the one that happens to go in here. That pump doesn't seem to do anything useful. So you can go into there and you can be a straight pipe. One taken care of. See? It's because I don't look where I'm going. Okay, so now we can tell which ones are connected by which ones are pumping. One, two, three, four, five, six, except you guys shouldn't have been hooked in. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, Who's going to join this group? One, two, three, 
four, five, six. No, that's that's six. No, it's five. Jeez, counting. All right, you seem easy to join in, so you are the one. All right, so I am going to finish hooking all of this stuff up off camera and uh, I will join you guys next time. So thanks for watching everyone. I hope you've enjoyed. If you did, uh, please hit the like subscribe buttons or leave a comment below. We'll see you next time.